this is actually a project that's been going on for a while. It was conceived originally as a movie and game franchise by a producer in England, uh, of Eden Films, which uh, uh, he, we worked on a film before called um, Tracker, which is a feature film starring Ray Winston and Tamara Morrison. So I've been working on concept art for this character, which is um, basically an epic kind of saga adventure, a little bit like uh, Lara Croft, Tomb Raider. She's a kind of adventure heroine, but the whole theme is supernatural, angels versus demons kind of stuff. So she's um, originally a fallen angel, uh, inhabited by a spirit who escaped from hell and is now uh, battling the forces of evil to try and uh, gain her way back into heaven ultimately. Well, right now, I think a lot of folks are, when they think about an interactive comic or a comic on their mobile device, they're thinking of basically just a PDF of an existing comic, something they've seen before, or even if it's a new comic, something that's, being that's just been released, it's still, it's just a very passive experience. It's no different than reading a newspaper. Uh, interactive comics is an opportunity to bring the person into the story in a way that isn't available through either through print medium or through just even uh, even digital distribution. It's a way to allow the person to interact with their characters, maybe be exposed to their characters in different ways, maybe be exposed to different viewpoints in the story. The reason we think that's really where folks are going is because more and more people are adopting mobile platforms, whether that's a, a new Amazon, uh, a new Kindle Fire, whether it's the Note Color, whether it's the new Samsung 7-inch tablet, these are the way people are going to be consuming more and more content, and especially uh, what used to be content that was delivered on the print pe printed page. So we think that's a real interesting opportunity for us, for comic developers, for artists, for storytellers of all stripes to be able to get access to uh, access to these uh, these new technologies. And the best part is we don't need a publisher anymore. We don't. We can do everything on our own. Artists and using a, a tool like Game Salad, especially artists, can now take their work, their creative work put it together using a tool like Game Salad, and then through our publishing options, get it onto every one of those stores I just listed, all on their own. All very efficiently, all very cheaply. And uh, yeah, I mean, like, we're gonna see a lot more of this uh, a lot more frequently.